Hello and good evening. My name is John. We're here playing Yashik. Y A S H I K. It's part of my Steam cleaning series where I go through every game in my Steam library eventually, then arbitrarily rate and or review them at the wee bit of playtime. Now, I don't quite know what this game is. I pick these games out at random, and uh, Y was the letter I don't play a lot because not a lot of Y's games except for Yee's, which is pronounced not at all how Y is normally pronounced. So, anyway, we're going to hit start game and find out. Okay, so it's a level based platformer. I wonder if we can beat this all in 20 minutes. I don't, I don't have a double jump. Okay. Um. Wait, what? Options? Why can't I jump high enough? Uh huh. Order is one bar, level one, access card not having. All right, well that's reset is on R. That's what you would expect. All right, how do you jump? Let's go to the guides. There's one guide that says, and okay, use F to lay down the appropriate blocks. Oh, I see. Can I get rid of blocks? Huh. I don't know how to undo blocks. Right. All right. So I just have to do it in... Okay, so I, they go right where I am. I bounce up on them. All right, this looks like a rising block. Jumpy block, all right. Okay, we figured it out. Bouncy block. And this one carries you. Not very far. All right, so bouncy block. And movie block. All right, well, there's some light puzzling here. Interesting. So it says I got level seven complete. I just need to get the card. Yeah, that's thing. I guess that's letter of the law versus spirit. Um, you know, I should probably just So or over over Right, so wait for it to come back. Try this again. Get really jump, make sure we jump super, super high. get this right at the end of the Maybe we can do it here. We start a little bit farther back. I don't actually have to complete the thing, but let's try one more of these. 
Yeah, okay. Alright, so these aren't that difficult to levels for the most part. It's an interesting setup to... Okay. Yeah. Okay, so that's enough range to come back. So I'm gonna just skip it because I can make that simple jump. So the problem is, is that F is right next to the the movement key. So when I'm pushing right, I have to let go of right to make the platform appear. So simple, simple. Yeah, a lot of these levels are not very complicated. that one. Something about this hitbox is throwing me off here. Right? No jump? So speed run, you don't have to finish the levels. Uh -huh. We did it. We did it. Look at that. DDQ, here I come. Where's the... Oh, the card's over there. Funny. Hold on. I'm not touching it there. Okay, so the corner... It's a square collision, so it's not like it's... You know, a major crime minor crime. Kind of silly. Oh. We're gonna get through this together. Five. All right, I got squished out of that one. This one will be the one that gets me. Trying to get it just the last second. Oh. 
What the? Is this the one that's gonna end it here? Is this gonna end my streak of cheating? Jumped into a wall there. So what do I think about this game? Um, the building platform aspect of it is actually kind of novel. It's just, well, first off, the game has some major issues that allow for, ugh, jerks to do cheating. Um, secondly, the level design is just kind of weak. And by that, I mean, it. I generally like puzzle games to have the option for at least one or two other solutions. And this seems to be like a one solution kind of game for the most part. Thank you. Oh, but can we make it? Almost. Now we're on a run again. Almost there. You know, I don't need to say the platform's the end. Oh, jeez. Some, it's the, it's the square hitboxes that are also a real pain. It looks like you're going around the circles of these mines, but you aren't. And that means you're hitting stuff you aren't expecting. I think that's what that's bothering the most is when I catch the corners. Yeah. Hard to see. You have to get right in the pixels, but you aren't quite getting over those jumps as you would expect. This will make it just. Sometimes it doesn't bump you. Why can't I place my last platform? I'm pushing the platform button. I have one left. I don't know. See, now this right here is a bad level design where, like, you die instantly. It doesn't give the player a chance to react. There we go. Okay, we can do this one, I'm sure. Nope, I should have jumped around that. It'd be nice if you could go backwards and undo a platform. All right, last one. that one too early so when it comes down to it do i recommend this game uh well with the glitches it's beatable in about 15 minutes uh without the glitches probably beatable a little, a little bit longer than that yeah see like jumping into that gap here and missing slightly and then dying or resetting, it's just not fun. 
So did we get all the did we get all the achievements? Oh. Uh yeah, all 35 achievements. So we 100 percent in this game. Uh this has been Yashik. Not really gonna give a strong recommendation for this. Uh, a bit simple. Controls were not uh responsive in a lot of areas, and the collision detection on those circles um was a little wary, and that makes it hard to uh plan your jumps and it makes the player feel cheated when they nick a corner that's an invisible collider. Cheers.